creaky. There it is. That's a nice fan. One of the most uh, best places to get a good workout is to do uh, natural chores outdoors. You know, uh, we're cutting down some trees and um, you know, we can get some pretty good swings in there, similar to like boxing. You can see one hacking away. And, you know, you've got some hooks, some uppercuts, and some. Now, don't do that one because that's dangerous. But uh, Callum will show you how to cut boxing. But um, as you can see, you're getting a good sweat. I'm a bicep, it's getting real pump. And uh, we've got some hooker slippers happening over here as well. Let's go watch your, watch your go over hooker slippers, buddy. Well, uh, what, 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 what do you work out there? Like, just when you pick it up, that's automatically working on your bicep. Uh huh. So, like, <coughs> you're pulling it up towards you. Mm. So then, yep. And then you've, you've got this one, which um, aims for this muscle here and, and your forearm. Yep. You stand your swinging around. Right. I can't see any grass there. Oh, over there? Oh yeah, okay, so you got a little, lot of whippersnipping to do over there. Well, yeah, and it also um, targets this, this muscle here, just yep. when you're holding it. Yep. Oh yeah, it's a really good workout. Yep. Uh, as Dave said earlier before, easiest workout at the moment, as we're doing today, is, you know, just clearing some, some unwanted trees. And oh yes, we'll show you that one after. Okay, so this is the whole idea. We've got six trees that are up here. We wanted to cut them all down, so uh, the big chainsaw boys that came, Cutting down all the trees, as you can see here. Like what Epic's doing. See the form and technique that he has. He gets to show it uh, really works out the whole muscle. But uh, you can see how we're cutting up all the branches now. Um, and uh, the pencils, the machetes, the boards in the back there. And we're dragging them, dragging them onto this truck, the tip of the truck. So um, we'll just go to the tip and then. From then on, oh, and obviously we're getting lots of fluids, as you can see, staying safe. And, um, he's definitely going back for more. Yeah, so that's, that's what we're doing at the moment. And, uh, looks like the guy's cutting faster than we can drag it on. So I better get back to it. So, see, this, these are called chaps. And the chaps are for, um, trying to look like a cowboy. Hey, Callum. Yes. What's the chaps for, Jake? Hey. What's the chaps for? Sorry, Dean, I can't hear. What are the chips for? These uh, are ketchup, so it's got Kepler string in the lining. And what it does is, as soon as the blade goes through it, the Kepler strings jam up the blade. <laughs> yeah, they're no good for knives and things because it'll go through through, but the chain for yep. it'll clog the blade up, that's how it works. Oh, the rotation. So it actually cuts through, and then as soon as it cuts through the first layer, the Kepler strings jam up oh, the yeah, blade. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. It's uh, a rotating motion. It's just how more cricket uh, protects <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, how more cricket. They protect everything except the most important one. <laughs> <laughs> the middle wicket. And there we have our first load getting ready to be taken away to the tip. That's a truckload of, I think it's about almost two trees in there. There's a boy helping out. That's, uh, that's all ready to go away. The boys are still going hard. So what's left? And just in case you guys haven't noticed, it's not David anymore. It's uh, Sema. Just uh, while David's doing some hard work, uh, he gets to take over on the camera. There's the boys. Difference from what it was before, as you guys might have seen. All the men working hard together. Here we have Sam, Sam over here, working Yay. hard. Here's uh, the camera, Matt having a break, yeah, um, doing some work. I thought we should be at the back and I was working by myself and I don't know what's going on, but oh. I'm back now. I'm gonna have another smoker. Okay. Oh, Dave, just one question, Dave. Uh, would you, how, how many trees would you estimate are in that, that truckload right now? 
I'd say about 1.37268 oh, on the tree. We'll be trying to push the two. Yeah. Hopefully 2.5, but um, we'll see how we go. Alright, so that's a lot of, that's a lot of branches and oh, leaves. Yeah. Yeah. I think it's going to be about five trips. Yeah, five trips. Mm. Uh, I'm going to hold you to that. And uh, I'll say if we're not, we're going we're gonna to know. I want to be cunning them on the camera as we go. So five, David reckons. Oh, uh, I'm not sure. You're not sure? Just, just trying to box it. Okay. Sorry, sorry about it. No worries, man. <coughs> Nick Minute. Yeah, but what's this working on? Uh, your clutches. Yeah. <laughs> See, perfect form. Okay. Perfect form for your lower back. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah. Oh, so you try to have ten biceps? Yes. Mm -hmm. oh, what's it called? Cordon. Cordon. So it's like a poison. Mm. And it doesn't actually go into the wood. Yeah, it goes into the roots. and kills all the roots. How does it get to the roots? just sucks it in through osmosis. The sap. Mm. Oh, that's amazing. That's what Peter's doing down there. Mm. So it just it kills the roots. Kills it. Yeah, won't put the again. Just look at the roots. Go, Ronnie, go, man. What does that do? Charles chose, and then you pull. If you pull, it's similar to doing rows, see? But there's no, there's nothing happening here. As long as you don't yeah. drop anything between <laughs> this, is, this, is, this is resistance training. <laughs> go, I'll show them how uh, when you pull it, it works on the on the back muscles, here yeah, on the lats. Yeah, that's it. Well, what you want to do is actually pull it out, so to make them, you know, make it constructive. But it's not happening. Thanks, Zippo. Can you, can you believe this is actually the third, the third load of branches and trunks and twigs that we've uh, pulled down from starting with Jeff City. That's one trunk, two trunk. Three trunk, four, five, six, seven, and Anthony's right down there at number eight. It is about two o'clock now. I'm knackered. Epp is starting to cramp up. Epp is having a slump. Epp! So here possible. we have it, ladies and gentlemen. Lunch time. We're in the Amazon. Lunch time. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, looks like fatanga has got some uh, some vegetarian KFC over there for us. Right. Yeah, they're just taking out this, this tree here, so we're going to church. Boy, he's getting ready to pull the tree down. So that's a full on needle.
good. What's up, Kalu? We're stuck in next to the palm tree. There it goes! Bottom boys! Oh, Sully, shoot something recording!